big windstorms tend to precede big earthquakes. Hi, EQ guy here. Presently out in the far western Pacific, we have a super typhoon with winds at 165 miles per hour. Was headed for Taiwan, although it has stopped. Looks like it's moving north right this minute as we speak. They're predicting Super Typhoon Hanamar will turn towards the north, and I'm personally concerned about Japan, because if it strikes the south of Japan, it can mean really big California earthquakes. Some other really big windstorms of this magnitude have included Cyclone Yasi, which came to precede big Honshu Japan earthquake and tsunami. Typhoon Namadal preceded the 2004 Sumatra earthquake and tsunami, and Cyclone Nargis was really big too and immediately followed by the Sichuan China earthquake and there was Cyclone Pam also just saying I always say big windstorm big earthquake giant windstorm giant earthquake that is Earthquake Minute and I am the EQ guy thank you yeah. EQ guy heard here explicitly on Who Cooks For You We're one and thank you DJ other Mr. S great show Super typhoon in the South China Sea, and they don't know which way it's going to head and what's going to yeah. happen. Yeah. Yeah. It's scary because they all get earthquakes, and you'd like to know which right. one is going to get the right. big windstorm. Could hit Korea, could hit Japan. Right. Steering current this, steering current that, and this group says it's going to do this, this group. <laughs> yep. And even they agree it's going to go north, but they don't have no idea which way it's going to, which right, right. path. Super Typhoon Hanamar. And I don't make any attempt to pronounce it better than that. H-A-N-N-I-M-N-A-R. <laughs> Hanamanar.